Sirelja, I'm ready for the final feat. <laughs> Grown weary of postponing the inevitable, have you? Something like that. You see, I've learned all sorts of things about Mamuk and your people. Is that supposed to impress me? I now understand why I need to surpass blessed siblings. The cost of producing superior offspring is destroying your people's souls. Look at them, and you'll see this. So I'll defeat my father's shade and prove to you that there's a better path for Mamuk. What drivel! Without the blessed, we are nothing but weaklings! Dude, to fade into obscurity. Of course you are weak. We all are, each and every one of us. But when we join hands, we gain the strength to overcome any foe, even Vali Yarmanda. Enough talk. Prove your metal against Gulul Jaja, the finest warrior ever to have grace to rule. Fine by me. Not even Papa's shade will stop me from upholding his legacy. I will fight alongside her. Claimants are not permitted to assist one another. Second promise. But you may observe your sister's pitiable attempt. I see. In that case... It seems I'm no longer a claimant. I am now free to participate, I trust. What are you scheming? Nothing. I've simply come to realize who is worthy of following in Father's footsteps. Not our brother. Not Bakul Jaja. And not me. You have always held the happiness of our people closest to your heart, Lamachi. So I will do everything in my power to ensure you ascend to the throne. This is how I shall repay Father for his kindness. This is how I shall serve Tuli Yolal! I could always count on you, Kona. Thank you. <laughs> it will make no difference. Numbers matter not in the face of true might. Guru Jaja, mightiest of the blessed, arise! Everyone ready? No hard feelings, Papa. I've got a lot of hopes riding on my shoulders. And the only way forward is through you! Bear witness to our resolve! 
Another risk which guides our journey. So long as we stand together, we're unstoppable.
Only this will quench your thirst for battle. My old man for you. I refuse. To accept this. Ain't that a bit stubborn? Even for you. Arugadin? It couldn't be... Tanqua! It's been too long. It has indeed. You are looking more imposing since last I saw you, Wuklamat. Tonkwa? My Turali moniker. Galul Jaja insisted I take one, saying my birth name was too cumbersome for the local tongues. That birth name being Ketanram, I presume? Ketanram's that legendary Eorzean sailor, the one with the pickled cabbage. We can talk about me cabbage later. Zarelja, whether you like it or no, these young'uns accomplished the feat. To deny Wuklamat her reward would be to betray the Dawn Servant's trust. And what should she be rewarded for? Calling upon her minions to carry her to victory! Oh, 
comrades. You believe a ruler should be reliant upon such? Together we can achieve anything. You needn't place your faith in the promise of blessed siblings. How would you have us reclaim our glory? <laughs> With friendship and community. With us. If you mean to rule, you should be more sparing with your offers of clemency. Especially to a man who has sacrificed countless young lives. Nevertheless, I will fulfill my charge as Elector. In recognition of your feat, I bestow upon you a keystone. Congratulations are nearly in order, I suppose. I'm confident that you will find the Golden City in no time. You've grown much and more during this journey. Become someone ready to lead our nation. Little Lamachi no longer. As your brother, I couldn't be more proud. Thank you. I must express my gratitude for your cooperation. And my regret for failing to live up to expectations. Nonsense. If you believe Wook Lamart is the woman for the job, then you have our wholehearted support. One last thing. I wish to speak to you both from the heart. Unpracticed as I am. This may sound hackneyed, but... I am truly grateful to have met you. <laughs> Words spoken with such feeling would resonate with any fortunate enough to hear them. Though our journey together hath ended, ever shall we cherish the memories. I. And should you require further esoteric musings or biting witticisms, don't hesitate to call. I dare say we'll come flocking. <laughs> but I get ahead of myself. As I recall, our contract remains in effect until we've escorted the Second Promise back to the capital. I leave my sister in your capable hands. See that she returns home safely. You've still moms to go yet, Wuklama. The right ain't over till you find the city of gold. I know. But if I can come this far, I can go all the way. <laughs>